Hey guys, it is me, Happy Sorry, and welcome back to The Walking Zombie 2. So for those who don't know what this game is about, all you need to know is that we are smashing zombies here. It's post-apocalypse, and our goal here is to smash as many zombies as possible. And if that's not an amazing goal and objective, I don't know what is. So let's kick this video off by making some purchases. From this guy, I'm gonna buy all of these basic lockpicks, as they are very worth it. I love these lockpicks. So let's get a couple of lockpicks. I also wanna get as many nades as possible. I might also even buy a little bit of 9 mil ammo. Not too much, but just a little bit. So it doesn't really look like this trader is selling anything useful. I'm quite certain that there is one more trader. And maybe he's gonna sell me something else. Alright, so here we go. We can buy all the nades. I do know that I'm paying 664 for four grenades, but... They will probably never pay off. I just want to use those grenades. <laughs> Here we go. Let's buy four extra grenades. Well, and that's pretty much it. We are done. Oh, there's one more thing that we got to do. We got to go to the second floor. We got to hop into our apartment. And here we can get free 100, 9 mil ammo. And here we can get some bandages. Let's get them. And now we have a couple of tasks to do. So let's do this task for Chuck. Because I've heard rumors that after we help out Chuck, we're going to get some sort of a shotgun. And here we go. Crap on the road. Random encounter. I don't want to avoid this encounter. Let's go. Let's see what's going on. What is this? this what about this that's it all right so th literally somebody just took a dump in the middle of the road and that's it that's the entire event all right all right <laughs> i mean my mind is just blown i didn't even know that such events even exist in the game all right so search the commode search the top floor find out what bandits are planning all right so first of all we got to deal with these zom zoms the good news is that more and more of you started commenting me that hey psych don't worry about those coins as you actually earn here more coins so don't worry about wasting your bullets and don't worry about wasting your money and i totally agree with that this game is meant to have fun so why would i save every single coin also i do know that it's possible to probably gather all of these zombies and just explode them here on this barrel but the point is it takes forever and a little bit to gather all of them just to get them to that barrel probably just wasted that barrel there but you got the point obviously this room is just good oh there's just a bandit i thought this place it's gonna be filled with- no, 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 Wait, before we do anything else, I realize- no, 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 stop it. I don't want to abandon this quest, but we will start eating those beans because you told me that beans and water is useless in the game, and I kind of started agreeing with that, as it just takes lots of space, but we can still use it to heal up little by little. We can, like, basically get our health passively. Oh, wow, look at how many of these dudes are here. What if I just- no, I I'm not gonna throw a grenade on them. I'm just gonna keep moving. I'm just gonna keep moving and we will get them. Here we go, another one of those dudes is dead. Oh wow, that's a lot of them, that's a lot of them. What if I- No, I didn't mean to throw that grenade! It just exploded close to me. I meant to get my- this weapon. Here we go, let's deal with them with my car. That's a lot of those bandits. The game just got a little bit harder. It usually isn't this hard. Okay, another shot in the head, another shot in the head, another shot in the head. Also, there's a zombie. Why aren't they fighting these zombies? Why am I the only one who cares about saving their humanity? I do know that, hey, there are bandits. We want to kill each other. But wouldn't zombies bring us closer together? Like, even if you hate each other, you would still think that, hey, you know what? We would fight zombies together. And maybe after we kill all the zombies, then we're going to punch each other. But nope, then we're going to start fighting together. But it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Let's get a bit different gun. All right, so we got everything that we needed to get. And let's search... Whatever we are searching for now. Oh, because we're trying to find out what's going on with those bandits. What are they planning to do? Let's say, take a book. Here we go. There is a book. Nuclear bomb for dummies. What? All right. So that's what they're planning to do. They're planning to do like that nuke. They're planning. If they're planning to get the nuke. Well, what if I go to the second floor? But I'm gonna be careful, as there gotta be traps. Just as always, this entire place is just littered with traps. Is that it? Are we gonna find anything else here? Uh, search the house across the street. That's it. We didn't find anything else here. All of those chests are unlootable. And there must be zombies! I knew it! I knew it! They're not gonna scare me with those things anymore. Even though I kind of still got scared. I still got scared just a little bit, but you got the point. That's it. Those days are over. Those days are over. And I still don't know. Some people told me that, Isaac, you will get a good gun. Some people told me that you won't get it. Some people told me to buy 5.56 five, weapons. Some people told me to not buy it. And I don't even know what to do. Honestly, I'll just probably wait until we will move away from this city. As I'm quite certain that there is another and better city than this one. As currently we are located in Springfield. Stupid zombies. And yeah, when we go outside, when we leave Springfield, maybe there will be a better place where we can get even better guns. So yeah, I could probably do some research. Just go on the internet and see what kind of guns to buy, etc, etc. But I, I don't even know why I'm not doing that. It feels like maybe that's big of a spoiler. Let's deal with this dude first. Here we go. Let's search the ground. Let's open inside. Oh, more bandits! Yikes! 
All you have to do is just keep moving before they shoot. Always constantly keep moving. Never stay in one spot. Oh, no, 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 no. Headshot. Dead. Headshot. Not dead. But hey, we do have lots of 556 five, ammo. Pretty sure we have like over... We already have like 2k of this ammo. Also, peeps told me to sell other ammunition that I'm not using. And uh, maybe that makes sense. I would say that that probably makes sense because check this out. We always have 3,000 of that uh, 762 ammo that I'm not really using that much. Maybe we should get like some sort of an AK. Then we'll be able to spray these dudes without the car here. Oh, buddy, so one more of those bandits left. I'll put them to sleep. Goodbye. Oh, he tried to fight me from up close with his like melee attack. Okay, I don't even know how to do a melee attack myself like that. Wow. Bro, I'm pretty sure there is a button to do that melee attack. I just don't know how to do it. Oh, buddy, so we looted everything. And we have to search the balcony now. Wait, let's get different weapons. I'm quite certain. There will be some zombies. I just saw something going up. Wouldn't be surprised if there is a trap somewhere. Let's open this up. Nothing in the balcony. It feels like we'll have to fight somebody here. Why would we get here? Oh, uh, found radioactive barrels. So we got it. That's how they're going to be crafting that nuclear bomb. Okay. Okay. So maybe let's go to the sewerage. As last time we tried to help Tony and uh, yeah, whatever. Let's face the encounter now. A phone. Oh, is there anyone here? Hello? Hello, hello, hello. Let's talk to the phone. Follow the white chicken, says the guy with the question mark. What? What are you talking about? Who are you? Wake up. They are controlling you. Follow the white chicken. What the hell? Catch the white chicken. And where am I supposed to get that white chicken? Who is con They are controlling you. I would say that, you know what? Aliens are controlling me because it makes sense. All right, let's try to get that chicken. Chick, 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 chick. Come to my pocket. You failed to catch chicken. Try again. I'm trying again and again and again. You successfully caught the chicken. Uh, talk to Orpheus. What is this guy? What is going on? It's like Morpheus, but he's like Orpheus. I get it. I get it. I got the joke, peeps. I got the reference. Greetings, stranger. I have come to open your eyes. I have two pills for you here. What else? This is exactly the dude who's gonna give you the two pills. I can't believe it. What else? If you take the red pill, I will show you how big the hen house is. I offer you the truth, nothing more. I'm so interested. What's gonna happen if we take different pills? I'll show you how the big hen house is. What is the hen house? It's, it looks like if I want to take the blue pill, we will exit the game. Is that... Will the game just end like that for us? I don't even know what to do. Maybe let's take the red pill. You're being controlled by people around the planet. You live in a fiction created by developers or more precisely by so-called agents. Oh, this game is just literally breaking the fifth wall. But that's a, this is quite cool. I like it. They are experimenting on you just to amuse the players. That's terrible. What can I do about it? <laughs> Shut up. That's not terrible. I am controlling you. I will teach you how to shoot better so you can defend yourself. Thank you. Oh, so we're going to get the firearms plus five. <gasps> This is good skill. Thank you, Morpheus. Orpheus, excuse me. That's quite cool. I like this encounter. Seriously, one of the best encounters probably so far. Besides, like, that alien encounter. That was kind of weird and freaky and interesting. All right, so destroy the pile with the dynamite. All righty, let's try to destroy that pile. Now there are a bunch of those zomzoms. I might as well throw the nade. I made a mistake for throwing it. I made a mistake throwing that nade. I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that. I could have just exploded that barrel and everything would have been fine. I can't believe how many 9 mil ammo we are wasting. How many 9 mil bullets we're wasting here. It's just unbelievable. Well, I might use my car here a little bit. It's not that bad. I like car. Check this out. In the previous episode, we fixed the bridge. And yet we have to fix it once again. I guess let's do it. Alrighty, there's another one of those barrels. So I might as well just open the door up. And... Uh... What are we going to do? All right, so all of them are going to start attacking us. So what if I just gather them at the same spot and I just blow this up? Am I going to save some ammo? Did I get at least some of them? Maybe. I have no idea. Well, we can get the zombie puker. I'm pretty sure the zombie puker is better be dealt with my 9 mil. Yeah, yeah, we, we're dealing with 9 mil much, much faster while we are using the 9 mil. All right, let's reload my car. And it looks like there are some more zombies. Alrighty, so let's try to avoid the traps. Got no damage from the traps. Another zom zom dead. And I have some nades. I might as well just use it if there is a lot of those. Oh, my goodness. Kind of got scared a little bit. Go, 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 go. I might as well go, peeps, and throw the nade. That's not 10 zombies. I didn't get my nade back. You need to fight 10 zombies at the same time to get your nade back. I just wasted it. I just wasted that grenade. That's all I'm trying to say here. 
Well, let's deal with them with my 9 mil. Bye. Bye. Well, at least now we don't have to deflood this area once again. Deflood? Is that even a word? I just said it. That means it's a word. That means the word exists. A uh, bunch of zombies. I might as well try it out. Oh, uh, no. Well, that was waste of the grenade. That was a waste of the nade. Also, another tip and trick that you told me. Oh, yeah, let's do it. Finally, we're gonna do it. So let's go to the backpack. And you told me that I can equip, like, whatever else I want in my other belt pocket. So I might equip maybe water. No, we cannot equip the water. I can equip maybe other grenades. Let's try to equip those other nades. Here we go. It's not like I'll use them, but this way at least we'll have some more space. And you told me to constantly keep my inventory empty, so this way we get more leather scraps. And I totally agree with that. I feel like that's a big brain idea. I'm gonna throw the nade here. Did I get them? I didn't get my nade back, though. I didn't get my nade back, though. All right, zombie mother, goodbye. All right, now we just have to deal with the zombie puker. Oopsies, got spit it in the face. No, 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 no. Avoiding, 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 avoiding. Here we go, De dealt with them. So while we are repairing the bridge, I might as well go and drink some more water and eat some beans. Here we go, they're gonna restore some health. We're gonna save up like a bandage or two here and that's how it works. So it's not bad. I actually like water and whatever. You can just quickly eat it and that's it. Oof. Oof. Let's try to throw a bigger nade here. That's a bad idea. That was a terrible idea. I'm using these nades left and right. That's bad. That is bad. But hey, hopefully I'm saving money on bullets or something. I don't know. Maybe there is a grenade launcher or whatever. I'd love to get that. I mean, let's reload my gun and now we're gonna use the dynamite. Let's go. Let's place it. Move backwards. Let's go. <laughs> Exploded into tiny smithereens. So let's go further now. Uh, oof. Ooh, find a way elsewhere. So we can't even do that because it's just filled with radioactive materials. Well, we can erode to Eden. Let's go to Eden then. Whatever other task there is to do. I don't even know for how long we have to stay in the Springfield. It looks like we could leave this place. I'm just staying here because I feel like it's worth it. I feel like we should be staying there. But how it isn't real, I don't have a slightest clue. Whatever, I'm gonna save some more ammo. I'll just get my gun. Okay, so did I deal with that big guy? Probably. Maybe I got like an insane crit shot or something. Another thing that we forgot to do today. Let's go to the shop and let's try to spin the free wheel. Yes, we're gonna get the 10 free coins. I love that every day you get 10 free coins. It's cool. I like it. So we're gonna get the reload plus 10% for one hour. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. So we'll be able to reload a bit, a bit faster. And I mean, it's a free buff, so let's get it. It's not like we can say that, oh, I wish it was 50%. I mean, 10% better than zero, especially when it's for free. Let's open up this. Get information about the cult. Um, uh, okay. Wait, so that's where we were fixing the stuff for Tony, and but then we go left here. Okay. I get it. There's the cult leader. Do we talk to the cult leader, whatever that is? Let's talk to him. Glory to the flower god! Are you our new member? Yes, I am. Glory to the flower, um, god. So stop messing around and do something. Prepare food for the plant god. It's in the cages over there. Bye. All right, the cult needs flowers to feed the god, whatever. Find a way to get the flower. I'm pretty sure this flower god is gonna be some sort of a boss. Like, mark my words. Oh, Lara, welcome, Lara. Glory to the zombie god. You're the new guy, right? Glory. Yes, I'm new here. Can you tell me more about this? The mighty zombie god is protecting us. The sacrifice of non believers is just a small prize. Good deal. Can I see our great god? Actually, yes, flower needs to be watered. Can you take care of it? It will be my honor. Great, I will tell a guard to let you in. See you later. So we will... What are those? What are they doing here? I don't have a slightest clue. Why are they locked inside of those cages? That's quite weird. I don't get it. Whatever, let's talk to the guard. He's gonna let me in. Lara sent me to water the flower. Good, you can go. Let's try to water that flower. I'm quite scared. Check it out. Check it out. It's like some vegetation's going on here. Ooh! Ooh, what is this place? We can take a bucket. We can probably get some water. And we can water the flower. Are you kidding me? How do we do it? How do we water the flower? It doesn't tell me how to... Oh, that's the flower. That's it. Well, maybe we have to water something else. All right, I see. We have to water all those things around the flower. But why do they believe this flower? Like, what even is it? I wouldn't be surprised if it even talks to people. Like, seriously, that wouldn't be even surprising at this point. We've seen so many things at this game. We've seen, like, literal aliens. So I'm not surprised if this plant can actually talk and manipulate, manipulate people or something. Everything's possible at this point. 
All right, let's get a little bit more water and let's try to flower this plant. Let's try to flower this water. Ha ha ha. All right, so let's water this flower. Talk to Lara. That's it. Can I talk to this flower? Maybe we can get the gun or something. I don't know. Maybe I can... Why do I even have this bucket? Why do I got the bucket? I don't need the bucket. Who needs the bucket? Not me. Whatever, Lara, welcome. Did you manage to water the flowers? Yes. Good. Go to the entrance of the sewers. You will find a crate there. Bring it here. All right. We will be accepting new members and feeding the zombie god. I'm on it. Oh, so they'll be feeding these peeps to the zombie god. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, peeps. I don't think there is anything I can do to help you. There's also a safe. We could lockpick it. Let's try to lockpick the safe. Let's see how many times. Look at this. Already one lockpick broke. It is insanely hard to lockpick the stuff. Also, there's a skill where you can make that thing go slower. But I already did this. Did we get silver? Three beans. 700 silver. Beautiful. 200 ammo. This safe was insane. Like, I'm pretty sure the easiest way to get rich in the game is just by opening up those saves. I don't really know what else could you do here. Get information about the cult. Oh, we gotta get this box now. And let's get back and let's talk to Lara then. Whatever that's supposed to be and whatever we are doing. All right, so Lara's already here in the plant room. All right, perfect. Go for the food. The zombie god is getting hungry. I trust you. Don't run away with them. Yes. Open the cages. So maybe we can let them go. Maybe we can let them go. I think we can open these peeps up and we can let them go. I want to know what's going to happen here. Can we talk to any of them? Wait, let's try to open that up. Action. Save the prisoners or feed the zombie god. Save the prisoners or feed the zombie god. That's what we got to do. I mean, we might as well save them. Follow me. Follow me. Are they following? We can save the prisoners. She's like, I trust you. We just literally met. You've never seen me in the entire life. Why would I feed them to the zombie god? Maybe we will get like some sort of good karma for that. We've got plus five karma. So we've saved those peeps. Smash the like button on the video just because we saved like those innocent peeps. But yeah, check it out. When we go to the big map, we can go to the open world now. But hey, let's get back here. Maybe let's do a few more tasks in this area. And maybe even today. We're gonna go to the open world. We'll see what it's all about. Maybe we'll meet some new peeps. It's time for us to get better guns. Let's talk to Chuck first of all. We finished some quests. We gotta talk to Chuck. Wait, first of all, we might sell some of those scraps. Chuck, Chuck, it's pretty bad. They're probably trying to make a bomb. What? Go back to the airport and try to learn more about it. I'm on it, so we're gonna get 6,000 experience. Also, you peeps told me to sell guns that I don't use, and I'm never using this vector. It's quite bad, so... Because it's a 9mm gun, and we have the 9mm gun already. Wait, before we do anything else, let's get some points. We got only free points. We usually get 10. Now we got only 5. I don't even know where else to spend my free points. I want to go for more speech. Maybe let's add some more speech. Let's go. That's got to be good enough. And yeah, check this out. That's what I'm talking about. So maybe we can sell the bucket. Bucket's kind of expensive. 1,600 coins. Maybe we'll be able to sell it. Who knows? Oh, my bad. I almost sold this vector that I'm using constantly. Wow, that would have been a big mistake. I'm gonna try to sell the bucket. We don't need it. Let's sell it for 400. Yeah, let's sell the bucket. Who cares? But we can sell some stuff in the trunk. Like, we could sell this MP5 for 1,000. Let's sell it as it's a worse gun than the one we currently use. We could sell this baseball bat that we don't need. We could sell this simple gun that I don't need. And shotgun, I'm using it quite sometimes, but this guy, we're never gonna use it. STG, sayonara. So here we go. We got some more coins. I can buy probably some more ammo like that. So yeah, let's get 250 ammo. Well, and we got some more stuff to do. So let's talk now to Andrew. Wait, Andrew's inside of this building. So we basically saved those three peeps. And now... We have to talk to him. Whatever he's gonna say. Did you succeed? The cult members are kidnapping people and every week they're making sacrifice to the flower. We have to put an end to this. Find a poison we can use to kill it. Give it a try at the airport. All right, so we're gonna search for that stuff at the airport just to be able to kill the flower. I get it. I get it. That's understandable. But let's talk to Tony once again. Did you succeed? The corridor is destroyed, but it's filled out with radioactive waste. Damn, all the work for nothing. Never mind. I will try to come up with a different plan. What else? Here is your reward. 2,000 coins. Thank you so much, Tony. Thank you so much. Even though we didn't succeed, we still got pain from Tony. That gets Sykes approval. I can respect that. But yeah, now let's try to get out of here. We could buy like that grenade launcher. It seems really nice, blah, blah, blah. But I don't know. 
I don't know. I don't feel like we should be buying that. What I want to do though, uh, before we go to the open world, you know what? Maybe let's do some more tasks for Chuck. As peeps told me that I'll get a gun from Chuck. I want to, I don't want to miss it. I want to get the gun from Chuck. All right, so there are a bunch of bandits now. Let's deal with them. Let's deal with those stupid bandits. It shouldn't be that hard to deal with them. I can deal with them from far away. Like three shots in the head and they die. Sometimes we get even a higher crit chance. So it's even easier sometimes to deal with them. Another shot in the head. Let's go in the hangar. Let's see what it's all about. Ooh. And we've never seen this character. This is the first time we see a character like that. Bandit punk. Reload, 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 reload. Bandit girl. Bandit punk. Uh, let's up inside. What do you do? There is nothing here. Try to look somewhere else. Kill bandits. All right, we gotta kill five bandits now. Maybe we can explode that. Not sure. Maybe that was a good idea. All right, maybe that was a good idea. No, he's, he has the grenade launcher. Why can't I steal that grenade launcher from him? There are more peeps that have that grenade launcher. Where is it, though? Or maybe they don't have the grenade launcher anymore. They just have that shotgun. All right, bandit chief. Stupid bandit chief. All right, we might as well go and eat a little bit of food real quick. Like, beans, beans. Yeah, that's it. We got... Let's eat three of them. We just get more space this way. Like, still, those beans are probably infinite. You keep getting them constantly, all the time. Explore the bomb. Ooh. What is this? Some sort of a cutscene. I wouldn't be surprised if we're gonna meet, like, that guy now. Whom he betrayed. Ouch. No, no, the guy with the Jason's mask, or whatever that mask is called. Whatever that guy called with the, with the mask. Oh, they're beating what the crap. What were you up to? Okay. Who sent you? Stop beating the crap out of me! Speak. Look at me. Look at me, I'm not gonna say anything. If you speak, I will make it painless. Yeah, this is the guy, I just don't know his name. The guy that lost the arm. Chuck says hello. Yikes. Yikes. <laughs> I will kill him and destroy all of Springfield with that nuke. Uh, doubt it. Sir, I really doubt it. We are ready to move the bomb into the sewers. Okay. They're gonna move the bomb in the sewers. We shall see about that nuke. Because you just broke the chair. Idiot. <laughs> I love our character. I love our character. He's so cool. He's actually so cool. Let's take the drill. Let's try to unscrew this. Do we have any bullets here? Yes, we got some bullets. Okay, so let's deal with all of those punks right now real quick. Here, go. let's reload before we leave this place. And let's save the humanity. Let's save the entire Springfield from that nuke. This must be the last task. There, there is no way we have to do anything else. So sadly, I forgot the name of that guy. He lost his arm. So if you watched the previous episode, you know the entire story about how that guy lost the hand. So basically, Chuck tied him up to some sort of a fence. And then he kind of left him there. And then when he came back, the guy just cut his arm off with some sort of a saw. And that's it. Basically, just like Meryl from the walking from the walking zombie no not from the walking zombie but from the from the walking dead i keep forgetting i keep confusing everything today something wrong with my brain but psych like, there's always something wrong with your brain i wouldn't be surprised you peeps are probably right uh, maybe i can get my gun and it will be faster to deal with them like this ah uh, die how can they suck up so many bullets it's just unreal that's just impossible let's kick another door all right bandit little person let's deal with this dude can we get the potatoes? Sadly, no. That would be nice to get the potatoes. Let's get out of here now. Anything outside? Nuclear problem. So what do we do now? We have to go back to the city and talk to Chuck, of course. Of course. Well, while we are close to the airport, we might as well search for that medicine. If that's even called medicine. That's literally like poison. We gotta get that poison. Alright, so let's search for the containers. We've already been here, kinda. The doors are locked. I can just shoot them and they will get unlocked. Find something to open the door. Again, there are a few zombies here and there, but probably I'll keep avoiding them. Alright, there's this running zombie. Dead. I hate him with passion, but he's dead. Also, before we do anything else, what if I'm gonna get those nades in the belt? Here we go. Let's open up the door. The zombies are coming. Send them to the grave. Alright, so a few zombies are coming in. No, 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 no. I'm gonna throw the nade right now. Did I get him? I have no idea. 
I have no idea if I got those zombies. Well, I might as well go and use my different gun here. As all of them are just lining up, so it's quite easy to spray and pray. Okay, but there's only one more zombie left. Let's get him. And let's search all the commode. And while we are searching, I want to see if we still have some space in the backpack. Yes, we do. We still have lots and lots of space. Oh, more zombies. They just spawned here like this. How is that even legal? How is that legal? All right, the zombies are coming in from every side. Die, 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 die. Again, we could be more careful and whatever, but it ain't big of a deal. Oh, no, we do have a slight problem. We got to heal up. Also, people told me to sell those rad X's as we can get coins from that. So maybe we should use that. I don't know. Um, do I have anything else? Like no food, nothing. Yeah, we ran out of food. They, they stopped dropping me water. So I might as well just eat one MRE. Yeah, let's eat that MRE. Maybe it's not the best. Maybe I just wasted it, but I, I ate it and it's good enough for me. I liked it and it restores my health. It does what it's supposed to do. Find something to open the door. Yeah, that's what we're probably doing. Let's get this C4 explosive thingy. More zombies outside now. Thanks God, because I was sick and tired of fighting them inside of that building. All right, there's a barrel. Probably we're not gonna explode it, maybe. You know what? There will be more zombies. And then we will explode that barrel. This thing will go kaboom. Oh, yikes. There are a few zombies there. So we might as well just throw one of those nades. Maybe I even got my nade back because we still have 12 nades and I think I had 12 nades before I threw one here. Maybe. Maybe yes, maybe no. I don't know. Might be mistaken. Probably I am mistaken. Go, get out of here. Collect four poison thingies. Let's go. One poison, another poison, another poison, and the fourth poison. That's it. And surge next hangar. That's it? We need more poison? I thought that's it. Oof. There we get them. Okay, so we have only 11 nades now. That didn't kind of work. Maybe we are all wasting those nades here and there, but... As I said, I want to use them. It saved us a bunch of bullets, and maybe it was worth it. Find enough containers with poison. Maybe we can get some poison here, then let's open it up. All right, so another thing is going to go kaboom. It looked like we only got one explosive. But here we got more. Let's try to throw one of those nades again. Uh, I don't think it worked. Maybe it did. I have no idea, but I am going to spray and pray. I'm going to spray and pray a little bit. My favorite thing to do in this game, basically. All right, so did we get any other items from them? Nothing! They don't drop anything useful. Why not? Where is my scrap? Where is everything else? All right, we got more containers with poison. All right, there's the second one. Third one, and there's got to be a fourth one. Here we go. Let's get it. Is that it? Did we got all the containers? Yes, we got them. We got them. So let's return back to the city. Uh, today, like, regardless, I feel like we are going to go and explore that other city or whatever that even is. It says, like, it's an open world. But now there are three saves. So let's get those three saves. As we're going to get, like, again, maybe 2100 silver. So before this, we need to deal with those zamzams. As I hate them with passion! Stupid schmucks! Let's reload the gun. Let's run, 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 run away from them. Die, schmucks. Here we go. Dead! Dead! My butt chicks were way too clenched. All right, so let's sort of open this safe just like that. Well, that's it. We opened out one safe. We got 710 silver, 188 ammo, one bean. Okay, good enough. Let's go. Let's open up another safe. All right, we opened up another safe, and believe it or not, I didn't waste a single lockpick on this safe. On this safe, we wasted maybe like two lockpicks. Here, we didn't waste anything. Plus, I got some nades from that safe. And what do we get here? Okay, we just broke the lockpick. Well, here I broke two or three lockpicks. Bloke. I broke two or three lockpicks. I can't speak today <laughs> properly. There's seriously something wrong with me. Well, let's say we can skedaddle from here. Then let's get back to the center. We are 31,000 silver, almost a 32k silver. And I still bought some guns and bought other stuff. I seriously don't see the point of us saving weapons. So let's talk to Chuck maybe. How does it look? They have a nuke. What? Where? Why? Yeah, underground. Because he had to chop his own hand. Maybe that's why he has like that uh, nuke. Maybe that's why, yeah. Are you able to defuse it? No problem. Yeah, sure. I'm a professional nuke diffuser. I know what I'm doing. We can sell some scraps. And yeah, this guy doesn't sell anything. We could refresh it for 10 silver. Maybe we could buy more stuff, but it's fine. We will just wait. Alrighty, so let's quickly talk to Andrew. Do you have poison? Yes, I have it with me. Give me a second. I'll prepare it for you. Yep. He's gonna do the poison. How's it going with the poison? You crazy old man. Oh, it's you. Good timing, my friend. I love to have friends. I believe that the poison is ready to destroy the zombie plant. Or any dead or living thing for that matter. Sounds dangerous. Yes, very. That's why I need a very responsible man to deliver it to the plant. Why like me. Always me. Are you volunteering? Amazing. <laughs> Come Thank here. You. 
It will only take a few seconds. Oh no, why did you kill this plant? <coughs> so, dun dun. I will take this syringe and stick the needle into the stalk of that zombie plant god. Oh no, you will take this syringe. Oh. The zombie plant should be inactive during the night, so try to sneak to it after Roger sunset. Roger that. Voila. Makes sense. God is dead, and we killed him. Makes sense. Makes sense. I get it. I get it. We're gonna do that. Most likely, we also leveled up. We are at level 32. We got five skill points. Sadly, we only get five skill points now, not more. I wish I knew where to spend my stuff. So I'll just maybe spend everything into speech. I don't even know where else I could spend that on. Maybe I wasted too many points on speech. Like, people told me to waste it on speech. I wasted it on speech. Now what I'm thinking, maybe I made a mistake. We also got some sort of a gift. We can claim this book. So let's go. Let's try to read the book. Skill points, two extra skill points. Let's get them. Let's get them. Better than nothing. Maybe let's try to increase the critical hit chance. Here we go. Let's increase that a little bit. Alrighty, so let's go to the sewerage. It looks like there's only one task that we have to do. We have to go to the sewerage to do two quests at the same time. But I need to do this task for Chuck, and I need to do the same task for another crazy guy. I don't even remember his name. All right, there's this dude. I hate him. The zombie puker, huh? Stop puking me in the face! All right, these dudes are just spawning in. Okay, all of them are going to die. Stupid zombie puker! Okay, so we dealt with the zombie puker from far away with my 9 mil. We got a basic lockpick from them. Thank you very much. I wish they dropped more stuff. They used to drop more leather scraps. They used to drop more of those iron scraps or something. Now we get no scraps from them. I don't get it. I don't know why. All right, let's go a bit further. And we have to kill all the bandits. I mean, right now, I'm pretty sure they don't trust me. I'm quite certain they don't trust me. Maybe there's a, another bandit from the other side. Nope. So there are no more bandits from the other side. And hey, while we're smashing these zombies, I'd like to remind you to subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. And always, if you're enjoying these videos, make sure to leave a comment down below. As it's always nice to see that people are enjoying uh, games that we play here. It's always nice to see people that they're enjoying The Walking Zombie 2. And this way I'll know just to make more The Walking Zombie 2 videos. Alright, so we have to hack the system now. Can we hack it? No, I missed it. Oh no. Access denied. All right, let's try to do it once again. We got some damage. Well, on the second try, we just got everything just like that. Boom, I just focused a little bit, and we did it. All that matters is just to focus for a bit. Let's try to defuse the bomb. Will I get some sort of a minigame? Oh, no. I don't know his name. I wish I knew his name. I don't remember it. Duke? No, not Duke. You again? Rocket. rocket. Oh, rocket. Revenge on Chuck explosions. Hobby explosions. Okay. Kill Rocket. Oof! He's pretty strong. He seems strong. Can I throw the nade on him? It did almost no damage. Wow, yikes. So probably maybe I'm just gonna deal with him like that. I mean, we, we're gonna deal with him. Easy peasy. All we have to do is just start healing up. I might as well... I wanted to say let's use the beans, but the beans are kind of useless, so let's heal up with the bandage. You peeps told me to move bandage uh, bandages to the quick slot, so let's maybe do that here. But let's add them on the belt, and then I'll just heal up whenever I have to. All right, we have advanced bullets, so they will be very useful on the rocket here. How is he so strong? No, 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 don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. He has lots of health. It's going to be very hard to get him. I didn't get the good bullets for this. How do I maybe equip these... Oh, let's equip these advanced bullets now. Here, go. let's get him. I know how to do this now. I know how to do this. We got to get rid of those. We got to put the advanced bullets. And let's go. Now we'll just do more damage with that. Here we go. It's going to be much, much better. Except we are running out of health. This is useless. Why would anybody suggest me to heal up from there? I can just heal up from here without any animation. This is much easier to heal up from over here. Why would I heal up from that place and then I can't shoot? Maybe it's not that realistic. I get it, but... Hey, no, 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 we might die. We might actually die fighting the rocket. All right, a few more shots dead. That's it, mission completed, saving Springfield. So we just saved Springfield just like that. Then we return back to the city, but there has to be another quest that I have to do where we have to sneak at night. How do I even sneak at night to do that task? I don't know. Whatever, we just saved Springfield. We also have to talk to Andrew. Let's try to talk to, to Andrew. Now, the only thing that we have to do is to inject the poison to the flower stem. Be careful and wait until it goes to sleep. Tell me more. You'd better find to refill your supplies. It could be dangerous. Consider it done. All right, so we also... 
have to basically prepare for it. It says that it can be dangerous. And when the dude says that it can be dangerous, that means it will be dangerous. Let's talk to Chuck. Did you succeed? Rocket is dead. That's a relief. Thank you very, very much for your help. Tell me more. Here, it's some old equipment from my glory days. That's it. We got a shotgun for the time being. Thanks. Hopefully, we'll meet Chuck someday in the future. We got a new shotgun. We also leveled up. And uh, what else do we do? We can just go to perks now. We got one free perk. Maybe we should get more criticals. Let's go. Let's activate this perk. Might be useful. And let's also yeah, add some more to critical hits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's nothing to sell from the backpack, sadly. But what about the shotgun? Is it any good or is it just another garbage shotgun that I didn't even need to get? All right, so this shotgun ooh, does 90 damage. This dude does 90 damage, so 50 plus 40. Not sure why it doesn't say plus 40, but it does 90 damage. What about this shotgun over here? 40 plus 30. So that shotgun that we have there is really great. So we got this shotgun, basically, that costs 10 grand. All right, thank you, Chuck. Thank you, Chuck. Let's go to the sewerage. This is probably the last house that we do in this city. Then we can skedaddle from here. Maybe, just maybe, I'm gonna try to use the shotgun just for a little bit so let's get rid of the car let's get the shotgun and do we have advanced bullets i didn't even take those advanced bullets with me i probably should have i probably should have all right there are a few zombies so if you how fast do we reload do we reload fast enough i mean maybe it's not that bad well i feel like i'll use my nine mil weapon here for now vector or whatever it's called and then when needed, maybe I'll use that shotgun. Maybe that shotgun just deals lots of damage or something like that, you know? Like to the zombies. Because fighting them one by one isn't really that useful. It doesn't seem like it's useful. All right, all of them are sleeping. Hello! Hello, hello, hello! Wakey, wakey! Hello! So we're infiltrating their camp. That's cool. Let's up inside. So what about that flower? We'll have to fight the flower for sure. It wouldn't be a god for no reason, right? I'm trying to be sneaky peeky. Oh, I'm gonna touch the bottle. I knew it. That bottle is rolling. Ouch. Zombie plant. Not eating cultists, eating everyone else. So yeah, job is not eating cultists and everyone else. Okay, get it. I get it. How am I still alive? Every bone in my body should be broken like 10 times. Look at me. I'm like, huh, you're dead. Let's go. Let's do it. How much health do you have? Maybe not too much. Well, what if I reload with my shotgun? Let's see how much damage we do with the shoddy. Yeah, the shoddy does lots of damage. I'm pretty certain that shoddy is good enough. Let's go. Let's do some damage with the shoddy then. This weapon, and I shoot him like that. It's quite easy as well. Do I have any advanced 9 mil bullets? Not really. We can just deal with this flower either like that or with that other gun. Doesn't matter in my opinion. But we do have lots of these bullets, so we might as well just use them. Let's go. Reload, 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 reload. That's how we dealt with it. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Even without the shotgun, we would have dealt with it easily. With those 9 mil bullets. That's it. Return back to the city. So let's go. Are they gonna, like, make me a king of the city or something? I've done everything there is to do. All the quests are completed. I mean, now we're gonna get a brand new location to where we have to go in order to unlock another one of those, whatever they're called, scientific bases, correct? By your smile, I can tell the only thing left is compost. Am I right? It was more difficult than I thought. Call a gardener next time. All right. I see you didn't lose your sense of humor. Thank you very much. I don't know what would have happened without you. No problem. So we just got plaster curing. So is that it? Is that it? There are no more quests that we could do here. Well, I tried to reload in the game. As somebody once told me, if you cannot find anything else here, just reload. And I reloaded and there is nothing that we could do. Well, we could go outside then. Let's, we could go to the woodlands. But is it really something I want to do? Nah, let's go to the open world. Let's see what's up with that open world. There's still lots of tasks to do. It says like 23 out of 51 tasks. So what else am I supposed to do at Springfield? We didn't do everything. There are new thingies. There's center. Points of interest. Radiation, etc. Et let's hop in the center. Whatever that is. I just want to check it out. Like, I'm just curious what this place is about. Bill! What's up, Bill? Hello, stranger. What is it you're lost? Chuck told me to take care of fishing, the construction of the city. Finally, I'm all alone here and I'm not managing at all. I need more men. Anything else? Go to Springfield and find us some helping hands. I'm on it. All right, so there are hospitals. You can increase your base camps. There are some trading posts. Maybe I can hop inside of the trading post. How do we even level it up? Uh, your base camp is too low. Uh, doesn't matter. Whatever that means. Wait, can we claim my coins? It says that we could claim them. Let's claim this. Okay. Uh, claim free stuff. Not sure what it does. Not sure how it works. All I have to say is that this game is massive. 
It looks like there's lots of things that we can do here. Building base. We could upgrade something. Not sure how it works. Maybe let's try to go to this place then. Let's go to the forest. Let's see what's up with the forest. Um... The, why are we here? Can we leave this place? We can probably leave whenever we want to. But why would we do that? I try to kill those two zombies at once, but it doesn't really work. So what could I get here? Right, so it's showing that we could go there. All right, so I'm gonna use these shotgun shells. Why not? So there's a fridge. I'm gonna exit it. All right, it didn't explode. What did we get inside of the fridge? A bottle of water, mate. Why are you kidding me? Let's drink it straight away. Let's drink it. Let's go. We got that bottle of water. All right, let's get some free gas. And I was thinking that maybe let's try to go to Woodlands just for the memes. How do we unlock the sun of the city? I don't have an idea. Probably after the Springfield. I assume. And then there's North Town. But yeah, I want to go to the sun of the city. Let's get back to the center. This is going to be a quite a nostalgic trip, isn't it? Welcome, welcome. What's up, Elder? I haven't been here for years. Welcome back. How are you doing? Great, thanks, but I need some help. Sure, what's the trouble? I need anti-radiation pills. Radex. Any idea where I can get some? Well, we have some hidden Radex supplies. The only thing you gotta do is dig them out. No problems. All right, so we can get those supplies. Let's talk to the sad chicken. Hi, I need help. What else? I can't find my husband. He just vanished into thin air. Can you please find him? We ate him. Yes, we've eaten the rooster. It was a wonderful goulash. No. Sure, I'll look around for him. Do you need the same one? Or we can say I saw him with a backpack and that other hen as they were leaving Woodlands. Wing and wing. So basically he left with another chicken, huh? We can either say that or we can ask if she needs the same one. Let's say that he left. That bastard, will you find me a new rooster? No problem. Yeah, we're gonna find you a new rooster. We're gonna find you a new husband, as they say. What is this game? Well, we're gonna search for those Red X supplies in the next episode. So I highly suggest you check it out my project, Zomboid Let's Blur. Click on the second card and you'll go to my papers. Please, Let's Blur. Hop over to my channel, go to playlist, and there you'll find a lot of other games that I played here on the channel. If you're not subscribed yet, definitely make sure to jump a subscribe button and notification bell to not miss any future videos. And consider following me on Instagram or Twitter, at Epicyric. Mm-hmm. Yup.